the time I get asked so many questions about how I maintain this or how I do this or how do I always look good or my best. And I decided to make a video about it because I want you to always know how you can look and feel your best, how you can look more attractive instantly. That's what I'm here to teach you. Seven foolproof tips so you can look better instantly. If that sounds like a video for you, keep on watching. The first tip that I can give you is believe in yourself. Everybody's gonna be able to tell if you don't think you're cute. If you don't think you look good, no one else is gonna believe you look good. I mean, it's just kind of like any salesperson. If you're trying to sell yourself, sell your looks to whatever, if you're trying to get somebody, if you're trying to impress somebody at a meeting, if you're trying to do whatever, you gotta believe in yourself first. No one's gonna believe you if you don't believe you. It doesn't matter what you do. You can have the fancy clothes, you can have the fancy shoes, you can have a great haircut. Nothing's gonna matter if you don't actually believe that you look good. I mean, come on. How many times have you looked at somebody and been like, oh, they look super regular to me, but Everybody flocks to them. Everybody wants to be their friend. Everybody wants to date them. You wanna know why? It's because they believe it. They believe it in their head, in their mind. They know I look good and can't nobody tell me shit. Believe it, that I look good. Start, because I'm here to tell you, you do. You look great, you look stunning. You can look better, but you look great. So just believe it. Tip number two. You gotta have good posture. No one wants a guy just lurking around everywhere like this, walking down with his head down. No, you gotta stand. Stay with your chest. Stand up, shoulders back. You know, you ain't gotta be like this all the time, but just up, you know? They may feel uncomfortable. If it's not your normal, if you are somebody who is like super bad with your posture, it's definitely not gonna be like easy going on, but you gotta tell yourself every single day to stand up. One, it just instantly makes you look more confident. I mean, everybody's gonna believe that you're more confident just because you're standing up, you know? You're not seeming like you're shy or timid or anything like that, which those are not bad things. But unfortunately, those don't translate to more attractive. I mean, body language is key. Body language often says so much more before you even open your mouth. So if you're over there standing like this, you know, in the corner, at the meeting, on a date, nobody's gonna think you're cute. Nobody's gonna think you're attractive. Nobody's gonna think you're hot. Nobody's gonna think that you're that guy if you're standing like that, you know? Chin up, you look good. Okay, okay, for the third tip, you already know what I'm gonna say. You gotta groom, you gotta groom. You gotta actually give a damn about your appearance. Not just throwing some water on your face in the morning, brushing your teeth half ass. No, you gotta do full self care. You gotta prep, okay? What are you? What are you doing if you're not grooming? If you're not maintaining your haircut, whatever that is, whether you're cutting your own hair or you're getting it cut, get a haircut, okay? Brush your teeth, actually wash your face, take care of your skin. This is the first thing people see. If you don't take care of that, nobody's gonna, nobody's gonna think you're attractive. No one's gonna think you're attractive if you got boogers in your eye. No one's gonna think you're attractive if you got like boogers in your nose. Yeah, see, I don't got boogers in my nose. You gotta check those things. You gotta groom, you gotta actually get ready for the day and also at night. You gotta take care of yourself at night because after a long day, you gotta actually do a nice bath, do a nice shower and specifically taking care down there. Because again, once you get them there, no one's gonna think you're attractive if it smells. No one's gonna think it's attractive if it's like not doing what it's looking like it's supposed to look. You know what I mean? You know, you gotta take care of you everywhere. Because once you take care of yourself and you feel great, you're automatically 10 times hotter than you were just 20 minutes ago. And everybody thinks the skincare routine is sexy. I mean, what? Another thing is focus on the details. You can have hella, you can have all the clothes in the world. You could honestly have clothes from Walmart, Target, Goodwill, wherever you can get them. But if you make sure they look nice, okay? That doesn't mean that it has to be $200. It just means making sure things are not super duper wrinkly. Making sure there's no stains on your clothes. Making sure that like, there's no food on your clothes. Making sure that your, your collar is down, you know? Making sure that you take, you cuff and stuff. You're making it look nice and fit well. That's what you gotta do. That, making sure the details are there, details are key. So making sure it fits nice. Making sure it's giving what it's supposed to give. You know, you don't wanna end up buying stuff and then you know it doesn't actually look good on you. Hopefully, you know, I mean, hopefully you're not buying clothes that don't fit. So you wanna make sure that they look nice on you. Your clothes are supposed to amplify you. But you have the choice. You can make it look however it wants to look. If you want it to look like it just came up out of your little dryer hamper, super wrinkly, you know, you probably wore it three days ago but just threw it back in there. Yeah, you're gonna look like that. 
But if you take a little bit extra time, maybe five more minutes in the morning, in the evening, wherever, and just make, fixing yourself, you know, making sure everything looks nice. When you walk outside, people are gonna be like, oh wow, did you, what, what happened? Something's different, you know, you look nice. This looks nice, wow, okay. People could think $2 shirt from Goodwill, fly as shit they never seen, you never know. But as long as you make that shirt look the best it can, you're gonna look the best you can. Now, this next tip, I ain't even gonna hold you. I'm not necessarily the best tip, but I do it better than a lot of people, and I am more conscious of it, especially now that I'm getting a little bit older. Eating well, you gotta eat well. My God, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm not gonna say, I don't say no to a few cookies every now and again. But you gotta do those things in moderation. Uh, I know it's really hard, especially for us guys, because a lot of times guys can really fluctuate in weight really easily. It's like, you know, it's like if we stop eating something once, you know, we see it result two, three days later. It's not really hard for us to fluctuate in our weight, and that's usually not somebody's problem. But not only is eating more fruits and vegetables gonna help you with weight management, but also it helps with your skin. It gives you vitamins and nutrients like collagen and vitamin A to actually help your skin look brighter, feel better, all of the things. And if your skin looks great, this is again the first thing you see. People are gonna see you and see that you look good. Be like, oh my God, your skin looks nice. Whoa, you know, cause you're doing your skincare routine. You're making sure there's no boogers. You're eating better so everything looks nice. You see where I'm going, it's a whole lifestyle. Super simple though, everything things you can do. And the seventh tip is working out. I already tells you that already. I know you hear people all the time, you know, working out, working out. And a lot of people wanna get you on these fad diets or like, these detoxes and cleanses and all those things, whatever, you know? My opinion on those things aside, there's nothing that's ever gonna replace actually working out. And I don't even work out every single day. But adding it to a weekly regimen of at least going once or twice a week, you'll be surprised to see how much of a difference it can actually make. And not only will it help you look better as far as your fitness and your buff, you know? But it also will boost your testosterone. it give you more energy. You'll look feel and be able to do stuff better. It, that's it, it's all seven of them, you got it, you got my secrets. There you go. Do with them what you will. Follow those tips though, I bet you you look better instantly. I bet you tomorrow, you do all those tips tonight. I bet you tomorrow, someone's gonna be like, oh, what happened? What you look, you, you look good. What's up? I told you so, but okay. But I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and also share this video with the homies. Let them know if you know you got a crusty homie, show them this video. Don't be fake. Share the video. Jaring is scaring. But until my next video, you stay sexy. Stay sexy, all right? Love you. Peace.